We've been getting reports of a bunny rabbit running around people's yards. I'm gonna Sorry, check it Sorry, kid. Out. I'm too busy to talk to you right now. Maybe later. Come on a quieter day. I'll take you on a ride along. I'll be way more... I swear Romper Stomper had a couple more years on his sentence. But you do have the key. Thanks. Now finally I can go see a Disneyland that hasn't been stuck into prison in some kid's asshole. You don't talk, huh? Me neither. That's why they won't let me out. Oh! It isn't right, I tell you. Out of nowhere, this huge Taco Bell is being built, and now our children are missing precious school time. Parents, we've been assured by the builders that they're working to fix whatever problems they've encountered, and school should be able to resume soon. Resume soon? Who do they think they are? They think we're going to see a, a Taco Bell as being more important than our kids' educations? What if it's not really a Taco Bell we're dealing with? Thanks for coming, new kid. Everyone, this is the kid whose family just moved to town. We've become very close friends. His name is... What's your name? Well, anyway, this child and I witnessed something last night, and I'd like you to hear his story. Go ahead, kid. Tell them, you know, about all the... Go ahead, tell them, tell them that stuff. This is a waste of everyone's time. If the PTA isn't going to do something about Taco Bell taking over, then the rest of us parents will. Come, Come on, on let's go! Come on! <laughs> Fuck the conformists. Why, are they a good lay? Why don't you exercise your free speech at home, little boy? Don't we screw it around in here? Look, I know how you're feeling, okay? But this isn't going to solve anything. We've got to get inside that Taco Bell and find out what's really going on. Help me with that and I'll help you with this. I saw you on the ship. You have pretty good control over your farts. Meet me in the bathroom. It's time for you to learn some real power. Fuck the conformist. Why don't you exercise your free lay? speech at home, little boy? I used to have a bad hoarding problem, okay, but I got past it. Now I can just throw things away. Would you mind throwing this away for me? I just need it thrown away somewhere very specific. I'll show you on your map. Okay, okay. A PTA meeting, young man. Be on your way. Young man, you have to find better ways to express yourself. I can tell you have potential, but you are undisciplined. Let me show you what I mean. Come at me. Try and fart on me. Come on. Kia! You call that farting on someone? You missed by a mile. Try again. <laughs> Kia! You call that farting on someone? You missed by a mile. Try again. <laughs> Hi, Tom! See that? Your fart's over there somewhere. Didn't come close. So, what do you do when people can block your farts? You must learn to control your farts to move and release at a specific time and place. I'm going to teach you a fart called the Sneaky Squeaker. It will become your greatest ally. Don't believe me? Try and block my attack. You see that? I distracted you. 
Distracting your opponents is key to battle. Look, let me show you again. Pay special attention to the viscosity. <laughs> Okay, you try. Make your fart detonate behind me. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, Mr. Mackey? Now it's your turn. Use Sneaky Squeaker to distract Mr. Mackey over to the corner there. Hey, did you guys hear that? Sounded like a chipmunk. Kia! Very, very good. Now use what I taught you to sneak inside that Taco Bell. Find out what they're up to and report back here. And no matter what happens, never fart on anyone's balls. You got that? All right. Now go. I love Oh, hey, I was just thinking about you and all the social status you gained. It's so weird that we aren't friends yet. I know, right? Move along, sir. I can't look at you without feelings of deep personal shame. Thank you. 